Hi everybody, we are here with David at Freddy Smalls on Pico, and he is going to make the Pico Sour for us. David, you're on! <laughs> Thank you. Um, this is our Pico Sour, our take on the Pisco Sour at Freddy Smalls. Um, the thing that makes a Pico Sour special and that people should know about wherever you're ordering a Pisco Sour is it is going to have a little bit of... Um, egg whites in it. So we use pasteurized oh. egg whites. They're, they're good to go. It can't cause any issues. But it, what the egg whites will do is add a lot of mouthfeel um, and change the texture slightly and really kind of give the foam and, and the, the uh, frothiness of this cocktail it, it, its uh, texture. So the next addition, and we will add these separately. You can see I have my cans divided. I put the egg whites in one and the um, lemon juice that I'm adding here, this is three quarters ounce of lemon juice, uh, into the other. We also are going to put two ounces of Barsal Pisco, which is a basically a grape brandy from Peru. Ooh, um, yum, I love Pisco. Made from the Quebranta grape, so it's oh. an interesting and lovely flavor. And the final secret ingredient here. We use an orange blossom flower, uh, orange flower blossom, pardon me, orange flower blossom, uh, simple syrup that adds a little more depth and, and sweetness to the cocktail. And then... What we're going to do is give it a dry shake. It helps froth up the, um, the egg whites. You don't want to have it sit with the, uh, with the citrus in there too long because it will end up cooking and basically congealing your, um, congealing your egg whites. Yeah, I was going to ask you about that because I've seen drinks like this made where they do the egg whites separate from the lemon and then add them okay, together you, you at the to last minute. Yeah, yeah, you have to be quick. You want to... You, you can't do that. Ooh, he's a good shaker. Do you use big ice or regular? We do use cold draft ice here. Makes a big difference. It's a really hard cube. The size of the cube matters some too, but how the cube is frozen and made, really. Oh, how pretty. This is that. looking really good. Little. What are you floating on it? This is just some Angostura bitters, kind of a traditional garnish to uh, Pisco Sour. Should it help you with the hangover before you get the hangover? Yeah, and it just adds a little different flavor and some beautiful sort of contrast to the green and white color. Right, right. It's really pretty. Woohoo! Are we done? Peace go sour. Freddy Smalls. Thank you. Thank you, David. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers.